think I'm ignoring my messy hair. It wasn't worse. But make sure you like, subscribe, turn on post notification. Sorry, I kind of didn't plan out a video today because I, I chose to be a little bit lazy and that's okay. I, that is perfectly fine. But, uh, so I figured I would chat with you about like dance, all of that sort of stuff. I feel like dance is definitely not easy, but it's worth it. And I'm excited because like, I feel like when you find, like, every, like, dancer or, like, person that, essentially, I'm going to say dancer. That's the best wording for it. Like, I, everyone that loves dance and, like, loves to, like, actually, like, a dancer. Or I feel like once they find their style of dance and they hit that life-changing moment, like, it's amazing. And then that side to kind of be able to and get that to battle now because I love dance. I love training to be a pop star. Or, but it's hard. It's not easy. A lot of hard work. Or, and I'm excited because Belle was at the point where like, she's the first person I really get to like, trying to like pass down that, that dance knowledge of mine. And, and give her that, like, life-changing moment when dance becomes, like, um, there is a little girl in our family that I do kind of teach her dance here and there, but she is, like, she's still very, very young, younger than Bella, and she's kind of at the point where, like, I dance is, like, a fun thing for her, and it always stays as a fun thing. But it can be way more. It can be life-changing if you find the right thing. But she kind of, like, at the point of still being, like, too young to really get that life-changing experience from dance. And Bella, um, at, like, the perfect age to, like, she's at the perfect age for that. Like, I feel like once you're, like, 10 or up, and then it's, like, then you can really understand it the most I feel like and stuff but anyway I'm right now um uh, right now sorry today I pretty much have just I've been in a lazy mood I mean okay yesterday and today considering I watched TV yesterday that was like the excitement of yesterday was TV pretty much the entire day, and that, that sounds bad, but and it's no different than me watching YouTube. Although, I did watch, watch some YouTube yesterday, like, but anyway, I mean, I just chose to be lazy, and that's okay, and tomorrow, you may or may not get a video, because, um, uh, I'm giving myself one day of leave, like, one day, I don't have to film a YouTube video and post. Also, I have dance tomorrow, and I'm excited about it. I have hip hop and ballet. Advanced hip hop and advanced ballet, and and I'm excited about that. And like, I I'm being really excited. Like right now, I'm just. I know, like, today, I, I'm, so lately, like, the past few days, I've been bringing back an old habit, a weird habit, kind of a gross habit, is what some people would say. For me, it's a perfectly normal habit. And so, a really long time ago, I go, so here, so how this started was, I don't like peanut butter. I don't like it, like, we, like, generally, only I just don't like it, and so, um, but sometimes in our house, or, like, family members would do, like, a thing for, like, a snack, and it was, like, eating a spoonful of peanut butter, like, that situation, and then it was, like, a snack thing that happened in our house sometimes, 
I'm like mine and my family's house. Well, mine and my parents and my dog Sam. And house. Well, so with one night, like with one evening, and when I was little, oh, I realized, oh, I really like ketchup. So, I kind of went like, if people can just eat like a spoonful of peanut butter, and then I should be able to eat a spoonful of ketchup. And that's what I did, and like, so now, that is a gross habit. That, mm, I enjoy it. It's ketchup. And everyone says, ketchup's unhealthy. All of this. And then, but if you check the bottle, um, well, if you check, uh, with our ketchup, which is just like basic, original Heinz ketchup, the good kind of ketchup. Um, uh, and you check, it, it's only 20 calories per serving, which actually isn't that bad. And that, I would say that's, that's fine if I was eating one serving, but that's not what I do. I take a cup, I take a glass, I squirt some ketchup in it, like, I want a decent amount, like, I'm enjoying a decent snack. Not too much, but, like, a good amount. And then I take a small spoon, because we have a bunch of, like, small, like, spoons. But they're not like baby spoon, and they're just like small spoon. They're like, like slightly bigger than like a baby spoon. And and then, and I put the spoon in the glass, and then I eat some ketchup. It sounds disgusting. I know, and it sounds weird, but I actually like it. And, but then again, I always been picky and weird with food, and like very, I'm a very picky eater. And it's like it's just a nice little snack that I enjoy, even though a lot of people think it's gross and stuff. And I don't know why I just told you that, but I did, and for literally no reason. And for literally no reason. Sorry, I'm feeling lazy today. And I'm just feeling lazy, and so I didn't plan out a video. You know, and I went like, you know what, it's okay. We, it's okay to be lazy every once in a while. Well, and partly of that is probably because I got up early this morning. And I got up really early at like 7 o'clock. And for me, that's early. Because I'm usually like, I know earlier than 8. Unless like something specific like is going on. Like the last time that I can think of that I got up, got up at like before like 7 or before 8 essentially. I don't really remember if this was the last, but last time I can think of was Squad Tour. And that was because um, we got up at like, not joking, we got up at like 4 in the morning. Well, no, it was like 4.30 in the morning. And we got up and like, I, I quickly got uh, changed and, and grabbed my in the car bag. And I went, like, well, me and my dad went. And I was to make a video, like, packing it in the car pack. But I realized that's probably not going to happen because of the fact that what I'm going to end up bringing sound here, but it makes sense, which is a pair of scissors or a thing of tape, a plastic wrap. And bags, like plastic bags. And the reason is, is because of the fact that at when my ticket, it comes with an autograph poster. And I like to plastic wrap it. And also, a, like, I, a, like, drawing pad for autographs and all of it. And so I can, like, put it in bags and stuff. Um, but, yeah, anyway.
I mean, I'm really excited about Squad Tour, and I feel like last time, I just kept, like, I wanting it to just happen. Like, I, I was so excited, and this time, I'm kind of the same way, but this time, I'm a little more, like, I, I'm trying to enjoy, like, the process of waiting a little bit more, because as much as I want to, like, happen right away, I know that can be done right away. Like, it's like, if it happens, like, I, right away, like, tomorrow, for an example, I know that right after, like, when it's done, on that, like, evening, I'm gonna be fine, I'm gonna be good. But then, like, the next day, I'm gonna be, like, kind of down that it's over. And because, um, last time, I was like, oh, it's exciting, I can't wait. And then, like, the next day, I'm like, it's over, and I wish I could just keep reliving it. And yet, but I can't. But I got, I'm excited to relive it, or... I'm excited to go again. That can be a lot of fun. And um, because for me, I can really feel like, like this is true. And my life consists of very little. And because the, and that's not like, oh, uh, like a bad thing. It's that what it does consist of, it consists of a lot of it. Which is that I get so caught up and like busy with like, training to be a pop star that sometimes um other things like just calling Bella and talking to Bella sometimes um like doesn't get to happen that often. And it's like it's the thing to where er, I definitely had to make the decision on something. And but it's one that's normal, which is is that like when you start dance class and you kind of have the idea of if you want to make it a career or not. You kind of have to make the decision. Are you going to be in all the way and make it a career? Or are you going to back out immediately because you don't want to make it a career? Because you don't want to be in all the way. Like that situation. And me, and luckily I knew, like, I want to be in all the way. I want to train to be a pop star. I want to one day become a pop star pop star or and with Abby and her teachers I know that might actually happen and that's something that I like keep reminding myself that like might happen and because I know like there's chances that like I oh like some of you are probably thinking oh that's a dream of yours that may or may not come true there's a chance that it won't but you can't think that way when I thing. I'm the type of person where I'm like, I'm like training to be a pop star. I have to, uh, I can't get sidetracked on something else. I can't tell myself, well, there's chances that might not happen. And cause then I'm going to be coming up with the backup and it's going to distract me from being in all the way. So I just keep reminding myself, there's chances that could happen. That way I keep working on it. And the more I work on it, on it, the better the chances are. I always try to look on the bright side. And it's definitely a lot, but it's worth it. And right, yeah. sorry, the video isn't much, but I just felt lazy today. I like got up early for like no real reason. And, and like, for no real reason. And, and, so now I'm like, I'm fine, I'm not tired today. But, like, I just feel like I want to be lazy. And being lazy is okay. And sometimes it's okay to have a lazy day every once in a while. Oh, and, so yeah, I'm outside for dance tomorrow. I feel like I'm, I'm just really excited because working with Abby is amazing. And it's like, it's amazing to work with her. And this, like, past, last time I worked with her, 
it was a lot of fun. It was a lot of hard work, and I was really tired, especially since she went, like, I, I want to say, like, close to, like, I'm trying to do math here. I'm not exactly sure, but it was at least 20 minutes over time, but it was fine. And, you know, it's good just some extra work, and I pushed through, and I put a smile on my face. Also, part of that was because Abby told me that we had to put a smile on our face because we're, we're healthy and we're able to dance, so we should have a smile on our face for that reason. So, plus, it's just a lot of fun. I'm, like, it's tiring, and there are times when I'm, like, I will this is a lot, but it's fun, and it's worth it sometimes. I'm going to go because I really want to watch TV some more. Peace out.